inspection on a bucket hook that guys use on their excavators. We're gonna fail it because it's been overloaded. There's quite a few signs showing that. It's stretched here, the master link's been stretched. There is excessive wear on the master link itself. There's excessive wear on the inside of the ring on the hook, plus the, it's been stretched. Sometimes the, the connecting links don't move because they've been, but the pin's been bent. So it's usually a sure sign, but this one isn't bent, so that's fine. And then the hook's been stretched a bit. You can see how the latch, it should be like there. So the whole thing's been stretched that way. Uh, so this is a complete rebuild. This is a failed inch and a half green pin shackle. Same kind of assembly, takes a beaten. Uh, it's got really excessive wear on the top. There's another sign is it's stretched from here to here. And if you look that this like comes in and it's not flush, so that the gap between the two is a lot smaller. So it's been, it's been overstretched as well too. So we will fail that and replace it. There's nothing more you can really do with that. And a quarter single leg sling. So just going through an inspection on this too, there's some obvious signs that you can really see on the bottom one I'll show you of the thimble eye being stretched. It's quite elongated and there's quite a bit of wear up in it, up in the thimble. Uh, the, the master link's not terrible, it's not stretched, but there's a little extra wear on the tops and bottoms from the, just the kind of force that it goes through. So we're, we'll just fail the whole thing because it's got some more wear too. But so mostly on this one, it's just been overloaded. You wouldn't see like the, the cable itself is hard to show overload. Uh, it's always the, the fittings, or especially the thimble. The thimble's a big thing to show if it's been overloaded and stretched. Wire rope doesn't really show a lot of signs of stretch until it breaks, but, and usually breaks right there around the thimble or around the sleeve but I've seen it break in the middle as well. So this thing we're just gonna fail, it's just been really stretched on the thimble compared to this one. I don't know if anybody can really see, but it's a lot more, it's got a lot better round shape to it. It's a lot more spread in there. Then we're just gonna, once we cut this apart, we'll have a better look at the hook. A lot of times the hook's fine, and a lot of times the master link's fine too, because there's not a lot of like stretch or bend on these. It's hard to say like until, until you get a better look at it and it's kind of item by item. So those three aren't even gonna make it to the test bed.